Hey, hey, how's it going? If you're new here, my name is Jam and I love makeup. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate you. Today's video is episode 73 in the Throwback Thursday series I'm doing using old makeup. Not oogie old, just not talked about old. Today's palette of choice is the Glam Light Strawberry Shortcake palette. This isn't super old, but I've only used it, I think, one time. And so I thought today might be a good day to bust it out and play a little bit. This shade right here is swatched stunning. So I think we're gonna probably end up doing a green look. My last two TBT videos were very red, <laughs> red, orange, pink. So today we're gonna go green. If you're into that and you're not subscribed to my channel, you could do that now. I upload several videos every week. If you click on the little bell and choose all, YouTube will notify you when I upload a new one and you can choose to watch it or not. It's totally up to you, no pressure. Either way, I appreciate you being here. All right, I am going to get you zoomed in, probably throw on some shadow shields so that I don't make a giant mess and we'll get started. All right, here we go. So these eyeshadows don't have names, but this shimmery green right here almost has a blue shift or undertone. So I really just want that on my eye. So I'm gonna go with my Singe Beauty E01, and that's gonna go on first. I am gonna wet this straight out of the gate because my face is done, and I'd like to avoid fallout if at all possible. I figured I'd mix it up a little bit today and have my face already done. For the most part, anyway. And if you're new here, I take all of my lid shades up past my crease because my eyes are hooded. And if I didn't, you would never see them again when I look straight ahead. So I think I'm going to bring this in even farther. That shade is beautiful. I don't know if the camera is picking it up or not, but it is definitely green with a blue shift, like a, a tealy blue-green shift, it looks like. That is stunning. Wow. This could very much be a one and done eye look. Am I gonna do that? Probably not, but let's just see how we go. That eyeshadow is knock your socks off gorgeous. I cannot get over how pretty that is. Oh my gosh. All right, I think I'm gonna take this big fluffy brush in the dark green matte and ever so gently do something with this outer corner. Everything else feels so like anticlimactic that that shimmer shade is stunning. <laughs> That's so pretty. I think I'm gonna take my Singe Beauty E04, which I really like for my lower lash line, but I'm gonna add a little bit of that green shimmer shade and just buff along the edge and see if we can't blend this out on its own and get it to look nice and smooth without having to use another shade. This is just so pretty. Yeah. Okay, let's take off the shadow shields. I may have to touch up my highlighter a little bit, but I just, I can't get over how pretty that green shade is. I am very, very impressed with that. I'm going to use the shimmer along the lower lash line, probably a little bit of the matte on the outer corner, do some liner, some lashes, and I'll come back, show you the final look, and we can wrap this up. All right, I'm back and that's the look done. Let me zoom you in for an up close at the eyes. I think they're so good. All right, let me scoot you back and we can wrap this up. Um, surprisingly, I think this is 
amazing. I think this whole palette <laughs> might be worth that one shade. I cannot get over how beautiful that is. And I genuinely don't think I have another shade in my collection like this. I really don't think I do. I could be wrong. I do have a fairly large eyeshadow collection. Um, but this strikes me as something I don't have. So I'm really, really excited that I played with this today. If you're wondering what else is on my face, I'll tell you now. And if you don't care, I'll see you in my next video. My foundation is the Maybelline Matte and Poreless, right? It's Maybelline? Maybelline Fit Me, yes. Uh, my concealer is not this one. Oh, right here. I'm trying out the Pat McGrath Labs concealer again. Verge is still out, so we're just gonna roll with it. My powder is the NJC powder, per usual. My contour is the um, Catrice Define, Shape and Define, is that what you're called? Yep, Shape and Define Contour Stick. I really like this. I used it recently in a video and remembered how much I like it, so it's in the rotation. My bronzer is the Glowish Bronzer in the shade 03 Tan Light. And my cheeks, or my blush, <clears throat> it's the Blend Bunny Cosmetics Bare Cheeks blush palette that I just got. I booped into the red and the pink and got this blush shade. I love these palettes so much. Oh my gosh, I just can't get over how actually very cool they are. And my highlight is again Blend Bunny and it's this shade here called Transient. It shifts green. Can I show you? Maybe. I wish I knew how to do this better. Oh, maybe there-ish. It's got like a little bit of a green tint to it. So that's why I opted for my cheekers below my brows, my inner corner, all the bits. So uh, let me know what you think of this look, this palette, do you have it? All the things. I really enjoy chatting with you in the comment section. Hopefully you liked this episode of Throwback Thursday. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Either way, I appreciate hanging out with me today. Be good and remember to be kind to you.